We think about the blessings and benefits that Mephibosheth enjoyed in the house of King David. We're going to sing a song that speaks of some of those things. It's called, Come Ye Sinners, Poor and Needy. The chorus of this song concludes this way, In the arms of my dear Savior, Oh, there are 10,000 charms. And there must have been times when Mephibosheth would have felt like that. All the things that he enjoyed there in the house of the king. The song also gives us the great invitations that we find in scripture. Come ye sinners, poor and needy. Jesus said, those who are well need not a physician, but those who are sick. I come not to call the righteous, but sinners. The second verse starts out, come ye thirsty, come and welcome. In Revelation 22 and verse 17, let the one who is thirsty come, take the water of life freely. The third verse, come ye weary, heavy laden. Jesus said in Matthew eleven twenty eight, 28, Come to me, all you labor and are heavy laden, I'll give you rest. These invitations caused me to think about who wrote this hymn. And I found out that a, a man uh, by the name of Joseph Hart wrote this. He was raised in a Christian home in London in the 1700s, but he himself did not become a believer till later in life. In fact, he said of himself, I was a monstrous sinner. At age 45, he came under serious conviction of his sin and rushed home from a service one Sunday, fell on his knees in his house, and in broken repentance, trusted the Lord Jesus as his Savior. He began writing Christian poems, this being one of those, and people appreciated his poems so much that they were published, and for the last nine years of his life, he pastored an independent assembly there in London. He died in 1768. He was 56 years old, and at his funeral, it was held at Bun Hill Fields, there were 20,000 people who came. God had so used him that those people came to show their appreciation for his ministry. Of course, that Bun Hill Fields is where the dissenters were buried. They couldn't be buried in the regular cemeteries, so he's buried there along with people like John Bunyan, John Owen, Isaac Watts, and so forth. So he wrote this hymn, great hymn of invitation and exaltation of what the Lord has done for us. Let's sing, Come Ye Sinners, Poor and Needy. <clears throat> Come ye sinners, poor and needy, weak and sick and sore Jesus ready stands to save you full of pity love and power I will arise and go to Jesus he will embrace me in his arms in the arms of my dear Savior. Oh, there are ten thousand charms. Come ye thirsty, come and welcome God's free bounty glorify true belief and true 
every grace that brings you nigh. I will arise and go to Jesus. He will embrace me in his arms, in the arms of my dear Savior. Oh, there are ten thousand charms. Come ye weary, heavy laden, lost and ruined by the fall. If ye tarry till you're better, you will never come at all. I will arise and go to Jesus. He will embrace me in his arms, in the arms of my dear Savior. Oh, there are ten thousand charms.